the far horizon, you're going to see Jerusalem. What is the purpose of the sheep, of the shepherd growing the sheep here? In the first century, Jesus' time. What is the purpose? Why do shepherds raise sheep? Right. Right. But think religiously. They raise the sheep to sell it and to make it a sacrifice. And Jesus was born in the area of the shepherd's field because he gonna be sacrificed as a sheep. That's very good. That's very good. We are in the shepherd's fields where the high priests and people will take the sheep to be sacrificed in the temple. And Jesus became the sacrifice. Yom Kippur. You know what's Yom Kippur? Yom Kippur is the day of atonement. All right? Where the high priest go to the Holy of Holies and bring the lamb and kill the lamb, put all the sins of the Jewish people on the lamb. Because when you sin, in order to be redeemed, you need to do a sacrifice to redeem yourself. Blood. It's all about the blood. All right? And Jesus became the sacrifice. Let me explain for you about the sacrifice in the temple. The sacrifice, in order for God to accept it, it should be the firstborn. Who was the firstborn to marry? Jesus. The sacrifice should be complete. When you give something to God in the Holy of Holies, it should be the best lamb in the flock. You choose the best sacrifice for God. It should be complete, nothing broken. Not much naughty sheep. Alright? Healthy sheep. Jesus on the cross, the Romans would come and break his legs. Because they don't want me, want you so much on the cross. Because there's hundreds of people to be sacrificed. Just to tell you. Hundreds of people to be sacrificed. And when they approach him, he was already dead. So his bones will complete. It is the best sacrifice to the temple and he carried the sins and was sacrificed as a lamb during what festival? Passover the disciples did not accept that why? they did not get it alright? they did not understand what Jesus came from to save the world and that was his name Yeshua, the Savior, to save. So he was so much focused that he done his will and he done God's will in his life. It is God, all right? So that completes the story of the sheep and shepherds. You said Yom Kippur or Yom Kippur? Yom Kippur, yeah, is the day of atonement. Yom Kippur. Where, remember the high priest enter with a rope on his legs? Because if he was sinning or a sinner, he will die immediately. The Holy of Holies is the presence of God. We're going to speak more about it in Jerusalem. That is where history started. Mount Moriah, the Temple Mount. Where is the Muslim shrine there today? All right, we can't enter there because of many problems. But we're going to have the best view. We're going to take you to the rooftops. All right? Okay. To see that area. All right? But now you understand more about the sheep and shepherds. Now it makes sense to you, right? Mm -hmm. Why? Because you're learning about the mindset of Jesus, who came from this part of the world. Because the topography, the geography, the mountains, the hills, the hills, is a testimony of the pages of the Bible. Alright? And this is why you're here, to learn about Jesus. Now, because we're in a village, they have the best food here. Probably this meal will be the best meal you will have. 
and people from the village do everything fresh, not like sitters. All right. So our next stop will be lunch. We have a spiritual food and a physical food. I know you love.